What's up, everybody? It's Chris and Gorn from PickDogs.com, better known as the Kick Dogs. We're taking a little look at this Newcastle United versus Chelsea EPL soccer matchup going down Saturday, October 30th, 2021. Gorn, two teams just at the opposite ends of the EPL spectrum. Yeah, Chelsea's still at the top. They're still going strong. Uh, the best defense in the league with only three conceded goals. Uh, 23 scored goals in nine games. And uh, But uh, they do have a few injuries. Uh, Lukaku will miss this game. Uh, Timo Werner most likely as well. But uh, this is the team that still has a ton of depth left. They still have a lot of offensive firepower. Uh, their defense has been solid. Uh, while Newcastle on the other side... We all know they have the new owners now, the richest owners, and they are now the richest club in the EPL, which is quite strange to see. <laughs> uh, but uh, now is the time for them to try and secure the EPL status for next season. They're in the 19th place, which is in the relegation zone. Only four points. 11 scored goals, uh, 20 conceded goals, Chris. Uh, the good news is they have been scoring uh, quite consistently as of late. They have scored in the last um, eight games, I believe, in a row. Uh, but uh, we'll see if they can go through the best defense in the league. Yeah, and I, I don't know if they can. I imagine that Newcastle might be the most expensive or most valuable team in the championship next year, but uh, the unfortunate thing for that is that I think that this is a game that's going to go a long way in determining that, and most, if Newcastle can get a win here, that'll be huge for their confidence. The problem is I don't think they're getting it, and I don't think they're getting it in a convincing way as well. You know, I think Chelsea just the far better team, and... You know, that record of 0-4-5 and 5 is there for a reason. Newcastle's dug themselves into a hole, and I think that it's just too deep to dig out. I'm going to take Chelsea to win to nil. It's plus 120. I think this is just a, uh, a statement game from Chelsea here. There is concern that maybe Chelsea takes their foot off the gas if they get up by a lot, but, uh, yeah, I don't think that happens here. So I'm going to take Chelsea to win to nil, plus 120. Yeah, I agree, Chris. Uh, the quality is definitely on the Chelsea side, and I oh, think it's going to be a little while longer before uh, Newcastle starts playing better. Uh, they are working on signing the new head coach. They are working on signing some new players in January, transfer window. Uh, they will need all the help they can get to, to, to stay in the EPL. Uh, and I think the over is pretty likely here, and it's uh, at minus 138, which is a great price. But I'm also going to take this a step, step further. Uh, I'm going to put my faith in Newcastle. I'm, I'm going to see if they can get on the scoreboard at home. Uh, like I said, they have been scoring pretty consistently, and for that reason, I'm going to take both teams to score in over two and a half at plus 150. Uh, looks like we're going head to head in this one, Chris. Yeah, but it's okay. That probably means hopefully at least one of us will be right. But anyways, with that said, if you're looking for best bets from Goran, myself, our Puck Talks package with myself and Rod Zawacki, shouldn't have mentioned that because this is a soccer video, but, or any of our other world-class handicappers, check out Pick Dogs Premium. If you're looking for uh, more premium content, well, click the link in the description below for our YouTube VIP package. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and drop a like. Let's catch some winners.